Hold that thought. With us now, sorry about uh, Pat Fortner. She uh, did not make it for the show, and we'll be glad to uh, reschedule her uh, later on in the uh, whenever her event comes up. We'll be trying to get, be glad to get yes. it on, hopefully before the event happens. Uh, but up next, we have uh, Pat Ferguson and Jessica Cleland, and they always come for Craft Fest. Yeah, that's coming up one. One more time. Is this the last time for Craft Fest? No. Oh, no. This what? is just our 36th annual. I thought we were going to end it this year. No. Oh, Who no. told you that? Maybe I just <laughs> heard that voice in my head. Yeah. No. That voice gives me trouble every now and then. I'm shooting for 50. The 50th. So we're good. So this is the 36th year. Mm -hmm. 36th annual. And let's talk about it. Okay. Is it going to be bigger and better this yes, year? Yes, it's going to be bigger this year. We have 109 booths this year. And if I can get the fairgrounds to enlarge the building, we'll keep adding. <laughs> um, we have over 90 vendors coming in. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have a lot of return vendors, but we have over 25 brand new vendors bringing new items in. Good. Are the yeah. vendors all from this area? Uh, we have some coming in from Missouri, from Arkansas, Oklahoma. Yeah, Alabama canceled. Oh, so, wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, one thing unique that I've learned about over the years is is uh, there's no things imported nothing it's all handcrafted okay that's the criteria and that's they, good they have to handcraft what they make yeah yeah and what they sell and you'll have can you kind of give a rundown of what what okay. kind of mediums we're going to see there uh, yes give me my cheat sheet there here we go we have pottery we have all kinds of sewn home goods sewn items wreaths, jewelry, specialty soaps and lotions, uh, home decor, candles. Most of the jewelry will be on the high end of jewelry, gold, silver, and gems. Um, we have children's clothing. We have magnetic jewelry, the, the medicinal magnetic mm -hmm. jewelry, uh, leather goods, uh, bird houses, wood products. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a couple of new vendors bringing some new wood furniture in this year that we haven't had before mm -hmm. so but we're always on the lookout for new vendors are you are you both got your own items in this year's show yes we'll have our own no, oh, yes. <laughs> jams and jellies and jams vinegars and, and oils <laughs> okay yes. forgot about that okay yes now you specialize in i, I think you did uh, i'm a knitter knitter yeah yeah she knits I knit. Mm -hmm. Mostly stuffed animals is what I'll have at the show. Okay. Yeah. Since it's time for Christmas, mm -hmm. you know, I like to make stuffed animals. She puts a few of my, because I quilt, I hand quilt, and she usually put, I don't have time to man a booth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm too busy with the vendors. And, and when is the uh, craft November 20th and 21st, it's the weekend before Thanksgiving, 9 to 5 on Friday, mm -hmm. 9 to 4 on Saturday. And we have a full kitchen, serves a full breakfast, and I can't believe they do this. Two eggs, hash browns, what else? Biscuits and gravy, sausage for $4. Mm. Wow. And uh, you're welcome to, you know, it's not just for the vendors, it's for the public too. Okay. And then they serve snacks during the day and a full lunch. So we're real, we're, we're pleased mm -hmm. to have them. Um, they are... I have to good time gourmet. Okay. Good time gourmet. Mm -hmm. It's going to be catering it this yeah. year, but our vendors have learned to uh, depend on them a lot, and it's yeah. a big draw for the show, especially if it's wet and cold out. Yeah. Now, do you have? Is, is there an admission fee? To no. Get no, it's, it's free. It's all free. Now, the um, I just forgot what I was going to say. No, you, do you have um, uh, drawings and things? Yes, throughout? we do. You we have a drawing every hour, and usually I say a drawing, but. Uh, the vendors donate either gift certificates or items that they bring and we usually give away about five per hour and it's okay. just for the customers and uh, we empty it out every hour and have new people Very come good. in so i figured up last year that the vendors probably gave away about two thousand mm. dollars worth of it, merchandise oh, on the them. drawing now do you have any booth space available or is no. it helpful? No? S sorry, no. Oh, no, okay. we haven't had any booth space available since August. Okay. Wow. So people may be right. thinking about coming next year, right? Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm already started on the June show. Okay. Well, we'll have applications there for the next two shows. If people are interested in doing a show, it's best to get an application mm -hmm. early. 
Absolutely. Good. And Good. just in time for Christmas, get out there and do some oh, Christmas you shopping. Bet. I do most of my Christmas shopping at Craft Fest because it's all quality, handmade, unique mm -hmm. items. At least come out and take a look. Uh, uh, meander around to all the booths mm -hmm. and you may find something unique for that one special person. And I just want to stress that it is admission is free. So okay. come on in, spend the day, have lunch. Plenty of parking, dry Plenty environment, parking. Yes. Uh, climate controlled. Mm -hmm. There's a dining room that you can sit in if you like or we have chairs all around the building. Mm -hmm. You know, so you can take a little break and then go back to shopping. All right. Anything else we need to know? I don't I don't so. think so. I think you covered uh, we, it all. We need to, to tell you that it is sponsored by the Arts and Crafts Association of okay. Mountain Home. And if you have any questions, you can call 870-736-1124. Uh, and okay. you will get me. All right. <laughs> well, if you didn't get that number, we have that number at the end of the show. You can write that down and get in contact with them anytime. Yes. yes. Thank you all very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Appreciate Thank you. it. And we'll all see right. you there. Yes, yeah. absolutely. We have, I have to look for something like that's on Debbie mm -hmm. Womack. Let's, uh, or let's do, you want to do the let's wood turners? do Lori Mathis. How about that? Okay, well, boy. Is Lori here? Lori is not here. Oh, A lot okay. Of people, we're going to have plenty of the show left. Okay. That's for sure. We're going to do the wood turners. Uh, James Pruitt and Darcy Didden will be here in just a couple of minutes, and we'll be talking about the Ozark Wood Turner event that's coming up December 5th. Stay with us. We'll be right back.